Mexican officials are looking for 31 crazy immigrants from five Latin American countries who were kidnapped by gangsters from a bus to the U.S. border at weekend. Federal Security Secretary Rosa Isela Rodriguez said that Saturday, masked men were standing on the bus highway in Reynosa, which branded weapons. The bus was traveling from Monterrey to Matamoros, just opposite the Brownsville border. The arms forced all 36 people through the bus operated by the company and then clapped 31 into five vehicles. Although the reason for the kidnapping is unknown, it became common for cartels to kidnap and keep them as a ransom. According to Rodriguez, the kidnapped immigrants came from Ecuador, Colombia, Venezuela, Honduras and Mexico. Colombia President Gustavo Petro confirmed that he was among the four Colombian prisoners on Tuesday. 31 immigrant to the U.S. border was kidnapped from this bus in Mexico on Saturday. Masked and armed men boarded the bus in Reynosa and 31 immigrants from five Latin American countries. According to local reports, passengers turned to the border for shelter with U.S. officials. According Rodriguez, Mexican National Guards tried to watch mobile phones of Army and Navy immigrants tried review supervision video from bus, and scanned by helicopter for lost signs from this region. But so far there was little clues. Five Mexican officials are looking for missing immigrants to watch their phones and examine the supervision video from the bus. Rodriguez said, we hope to find the location of the victims quickly. Rodriguez said, the secretary stated that the number of immigrants kidnapped on December 30 is unusual because recently, gangs are sometimes holding people in small groups, sometimes for buses and ransom. Immigrants and human rights activists have been raising red flags about an increasing kidnapping crisis in guilty Tamaulipas border region in Reynosa, which has become a bed of rival gangs fighting for the control of region for months. 5. The kidnapping of immigrants in Mexico by gangs for ransom is not rare. CN 13 Notmaras Tamaulipas is not a stranger to kidnap the province. In 2010, members of the unmistakable Zetas drug cartel killed 72 middle American immigrants after forcing the buses near San Fernando.